I am so upset with myself. Hey everybody, welcome to my channel. If you're here for the first time, welcome. My name is Martina, and for my regular viewers, welcome back. So, like I said, as I started this video, I am so upset with myself. Um, the reason I'm saying that, let me share with you my story. It's not really like about manifesting. It's just basically about a little rant and um, just a little vlog, right? So I have this friend client right who i do some bookkeeping for i noticed i know this gentleman that since i got here um for quite a few years about 18 years since i arrived at the bbi right and um now that i'm working from home occasionally i would do some bookkeeping services for him right so when i came back from from trinidad after hurricane Irma, um i did some work for him and maybe about six or seven months in work right and that was early on in january um and i haven't heard from him since right um because I know like time is passing, we have February, March, April to do, right? Um, we do, do the bookkeeping service every month, right? So we have a backlog building up. So I haven't been hearing from him, you know, so I said, well, I find it's kind of odd, you know, but I said, you know what? You know, I'm, I'm not really hustling the hustle behind him, so I'm just not going to call. But what my thinking is, you know, like with law of attraction, the more you think about, you bring about. So I said to myself, I'm not going to think about him and just leave it like that, right? I don't want to track him. I'm not going to think about him. That's what I was saying to myself, right? So I said that to myself. And then about two days ago, I was going through my Facebook um, feed, right? And I saw a picture of an old man, right? Now, this old man is my friend's father. So as I look closer, the gentleman died. Now I know this old man for well since I like since I came to the BB, I worked with him and he taught me a lot. A very nice old man, very stern but very soft spoken and kind hearted and everything, right? And he taught me a lot. So like he's like he's like a father for the whole company. We used to call him Uncle JP, right? Uncle or Uncle J, right? So I saw the photograph and I said, Oh my gosh. This is why I have me here for my friend, right? And I, right away, I respond. Now, the person who left that post with the picture was my friend's cousin. So right away, I left a post, you know, um, sharing my condolences and sympathies and things like that. And in addition to, I went, because normally I chat with my friend via um, Facebook Messenger privately, right? And I, I left a message for him. I said, hey, I now saw that, you know, your, your father had died because I, he previously to that he was ill um, him, himself he and my mother around the same age um, in their 90s right and he was ailing a little bit um, his memory was intact my, based on what my friend said but apparently he had some physical issues and so forth right so I guess it took hold of him and he transitioned right and so you know I was kind of surprised but you know I know but we all know it was coming and my friend is so funny I'll ask him and I'll ask him you know I said how is your dad and he will say i don't know why he'll just go ahead and die you know he's just being funny but i know deep down in his heart he was just being silly and being funny and i know he loves his dad he's a family oriented um guy and i'm sure he's really hurting right now so like i said before as i was saying before i contacted him via um facebook messenger and i said hey i just found out about the news about your dad um i set my condolences and stuff and in the next day afterwards she responded and said thank you when i when he come back to talk to her we will talk talk to each other and everything you know so i felt so bad about, my, about myself you know with myself because you know i was being uh, kind of upset with him you know not hearing from him and that kind of thing and kind of like wiping him out and lo and behold the man was going through some little issues with his family his father died you know so anyway things happen you know so that's the reason why i wasn't hearing from him his father is dead okay just want to share this today like i said like a little vlog a little rant you know um yeah okay thanks for watching take care bye bye happy mother's day for my for my subscribers who are mothers happy mother's day